hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i have a born pretty pr package as well as a couple of items that i ordered so we're gonna take a look at them swatch everything and play a little bit so let's take a look at the item that born pretty sent they sent me this six piece neon fluorescent gel polish set let me get it out of the packaging and then we can take a look at the colors and get to swatching. So this is a set guys and as usual each six piece gel polish set comes with a little booklet that gives application removal instructions etc so that's that and i just love this packaging the all shine on me packaging so pretty now here are the polishes we have six colors first we have bpmc zero one And this is a beautiful neon green. Next, we have BPMC02 neon yellow. Next up, we have BPMC03, which is an orange, a neon orange. Look how bright that is. Next up, we have BPMC04, neon pink, of course. Next up, we have BPMC05, which is a kind of aqua blue. I don't think, is this a neon blue? I, it's a pretty blue. Next up, we have BPMC06. And that's a pretty purple. It's a kind of lilac-y purple, pinky purple but pretty either way so let's get to swatching we're gonna swatch them in order so we have bpmc01 with the neon green and i'm gonna quiet down a little bit so relax and enjoy the swatches i'll be back shortly
so here we have them you guys these are all the colors swatched in the um six piece gel polish set that i received now let's take a look at the few items that i ordered myself and guys i went onto the website with getting the basics in mind because i wanted to get their base coat and their matte top coat that is what i had in mind but when i went onto the website something else caught my eye <laughs> and i totally forgot about those things but anyways the first item is a jelly white it is the born pretty jelly nude gel bpjn01 So that is the jelly white and hmm. all right so I all along with that jelly white as you can see I got the Aurora neon nonstick extension nail gels and I love how they come in the boxes but got rid of the packaging so here we have NSG one nine and we're gonna be swatching these as well but let's get everything open and take a look first look at that guys that is gorgeous Y'all know I love anything with glitter or shimmer. This is beautiful. And of course, y'all know the consistency of the nonstick extension gels. It's very similar or the same as the um, solid nail glue gels, except no sticky residue. So next up, we have... NSG20 and this has a very pretty purple shimmer it shifts the shimmer shifts from pink to purple next up we have NSG21 and this one is a gold gold and blue shimmer very pretty as as you can see the camera does not do them justice so as pretty as they look on camera they are even prettier in person and last but not least we have nsg22 and this gives me ocean mermaid vibes through and through so that is those. Again, those are the Aurora Non-Stick Hand Extension Nail Gels. Look at all those colors. So pretty. Shimmer, shimmer. Okay, so let's put those away for now. We're going to be swatching them, but let's take a look at the other items. And then we'll watch everything once we're done so the next set of items I picked up five of the born pretty pat paint gels so first we have PP01 wait 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 PP01 yes that's PP01 which is the white giving it a little stir and then let's and it's when I say it is a white white guys like no yellowish tint just like a pretty pretty white next up this is PP05 
Next, we have PP08. Which is a kind of pale red. It's a red, but on the paler side. Next up, we have PP09, which is a brighter red. Of course, I had to get the brighter red. Yeah, and what, what's a video from me without an accident? Had to make a mess somewhere. <laughs> Anyways, look at how pretty that red is, guys. And guys, these are very, very pigmented. Like, you don't need more than a drop of these at a time. And last but not least, this is PP12, which is the black. And they're all pretty much the same consistency. I don't see any difference based on the colors, so yeah so those are the pat paint gels from born pretty and we're gonna go ahead and swatch but let's swatch the jelly white first and then we'll move on to the pat paint gels and then the aurora non-stick extension gels So that's the Jelly Nude White, I mean the Jelly Nude Gel 01, which is the Milky White. Let's move on to these Pat Paint Gels because I'm fascinated by these. I'm just taking out a tiny bit of each color so that we can swatch all of them. Sped this part up a bit because we don't want this video to go on all day. And it would. And guys, you can see that I'm only taking out a tiny, tiny amount of each color. And the tiny amount that I took out is too much. So I've already prepped some swatch sticks with matte top coat and I'm going to be using some of these um, stencil stickers to um, kind of do a little design type thing with the pat paint gels. So I'm going to apply these to each of the swatch sticks. Naturally I use a black swatch for the um, white pat paint gel and then I'll use white for the rest
okay so i have all my stencil stickers applied and here is the milky white gel again fully cured so let us start with the black pat paint gel and guys just look how pigmented this black is i take up just a bit of the pat paint gel and look at it so pigmented Now this, this swatch does end up being um, a bit of a fail because in trying to remove the, uh, in trying to remove the sticker so we can get the design, I actually end up peeling off the matte top coat <laughs> that I used on the swatch. So the black is a fail and we're going to move on to the rest. The rest come out better so bear with me i'm gonna pipe down a bit so you guys can enjoy the swatching and then i'll be back shortly it just started to rain
I hope the rain is not too loud but here we have them you guys so this is the white and I love how these work I'll definitely be playing with these more in the future this is the paler pink and I did top coat two with shiny top coat and two with matte and this is the bright red and I only did one coat on these I didn't double coat them because it's absolutely not necessary with these pigmented gels so those are the pat paint gels we're gonna move on to the Aurora non-stick gels so let's swatch each of them I'm doing them in order as well so the first one is NSG 19 and I removed my glove because for me the gels tend to stick to my glove but I've seen people use gloves with them and they don't stick so I, I don't know maybe it's just my bad luck but I'm just using my fingers because these gels are safe for use in this way they don't leave any gel residue on your hands anything like that so it's okay to go ahead and use your fingers with these I'm just pressing them into the swatch just to ensure that it covers the swatch fully and you all saw that tiny ball that I took out and yeah so <laughs> I'm gonna pipe down kick back and enjoy the rest of the swatching I'll be back shortly
Okay, guys, swatching over. So here we have the non-stick extension gels again, the Aurora non-stick extension gels again, fully cured. This is, again, NSG19. These are so pretty. And guys, uh, this video ended up being way too long. So this is just part one. I'll be posting part two of this tomorrow, which is where I do my nails using some of these items. So that was NSG20. This is NSG21. And finally, NSG22 which is the blue-green. These are gorgeous. So I love all these products that I got. I love the polishes that Born Pretty sent me. And in part two coming up, I will be using the gel polishes and the pack paint gels, at least one of them, on my set. So tune in for that tomorrow and thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed hit that thumbs up if you did and i'll see you in tomorrow's part two bye